Hello, MacWarriors. How is it going? And welcome to another episode of MacWarrior 5 Mercenaries. Today, I'm excited because I want to try to get some medium max into my roster. I would love to get a Shadowhawk, maybe a Griffin or something. Hunchback would be fine. Vulcans are also good. And for that, we're going to use our Urban Mag. I think the build kind of works. We have the machine guns and the medium pulse lasers. And since we are already repairing our max, we have nothing else to do but pick a mission. And we have a quest here, a high priority mission for House Liao, which we are in good standing with, against House Davian, which kind of start hating us. And yeah, we're gonna play a... Uh, what's the mission type? A war zone here. Alright, look at that. All the money, all the salvage, all the damage coverage, and even an airstrike, which I will most likely forget. But anyway, let's go in. Eight days to wait. And, and we are ready to go. Huh? You ready? Yeah, you're ready. A little bit laggy here, but okay. Wait, what is that biome? Noxious fog. Thick clouds of volcanic smoke, lower visibility, sensor range, and energy weapon effectiveness. That's kind of interesting. I never really played around these things. Do we need to? I don't think it's necessary. Maybe it's necessary in the early game where you really want to pack as much punch as possible. But at the other, on the other hand, we don't really have options. Like, what could we do? Not run the fire starter and run the cicada instead? I just, there's nothing in there. Oh my god. Also, we have a breach in the, in the leopard. The fog is already in the leopard. We need to check the seals here, Rihanna. Come on, give Fahad a raise and some more materials to actually fix that dropship. Imagine that. This is a space-capable craft that is not able to contain or uh, the other way around. Like, keep the fog out when going into atmosphere. <laughs> Let's go. Alright, we got a light mech coming in. A good old javelin. Yeah, hey, and by the way, my airstrike is probably not worth... He's flying. Not worth anything. Because, um... We are currently in the early game, and light makes zip around like crazy, so they will probably avoid the spot that I dropped the artillery strike on. As a result, I don't think it's gonna be really good. And I want my my friends to not run into the artillery, so I think I'm not gonna drop it at all. Javelin down. Took a little bit of damage here. That's okay, back to base. Is lighting up with more targets converging on your position. Bye, Rihanna. Stay frosty. You will be missed. All right. So, who's here? Anybody coming? Rihanna, sa Rihanna said that something was lighting up with something. I don't see anything. Getting shot at. Oh, you got auto cannon twos. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so VTOL first. That thing's nasty. Up, 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 up. Any other one? Get him. I, I really like that we have such a great pitch angle. Good. Uh, a little bit too far out. Why are you shooting your machine guns? You don't have the range for it. AI does some, some weird decisions here. Or makes some weird decisions. Alright, we got an SRM carrier. We actually got two SRM carriers. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna send my people to the right one. I'm gonna take the other one. Come on, guys. Do it together. I believe in you. You can get things done. Alright, and I'm gonna go over here. With the, oh, with the machine guns. This is working out so far, but there might be, again, there might be medium mechs coming, and this is what we are here for today. That's a Shadowhawk! Yes, let's go! Alright. Um... Actually... I don't know if it's gonna do anything. Heat vision better? I think heat vision better. Get wrecked! Ah, yeah, he dodged it. That, the, the Locust got it. The Locust got it. That is very good aiming. All right, we're gonna take the SRM dude, because he is he's a glass cannon. He has lots of firepower, but it's rather easy to destroy. And then... Ooh, what happened here? That's good. Leg down on the left leg now. While we add it, we can also take some salvage with us. This might be good for us. So yeah, I'll take a Shadowhawk. Why not? We have some parts already. 
don't have a full hog yet, but we might get there. So, LRM, Vito, more mediums, Hollander, Assassin. All right, the, the Hollander is nasty. He got a Gauss rifle. Okay, probably should go for him first. At the same time, this is 12 S. What? Oh, sensor sweep. This is 12 SRMs. Uh, actually, let's take the SRMs first. It's just more shredding power that he has there. Hollander has a very low rate of fire. This gay guy, not gay. Who knows? I don't know. Uh, this guy has a lot of, again, shredding uh, potential fast firing SRMs and lots of them. Engaging commander's target. All right, here we go. Bop, bop, bop. Oh, let's go for the blue vision. I think the blue vision is the best one. In a scenario like that. So we also want to see our target. And by the way, yes, um, guys, I tried disabling my super extreme weather effects and, and lighting and stuff for the fun biome lighting to come through. There's nothing special. There, there's nothing at all that was enabled, really. Nothing that I could distinguish from the base game. So I want to keep my super uh, FX weather thing here. So, sorry from biomes. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong, but eh, it, this is good. I like the fog and everything here. So we could stay a little longer, but you know what? I don't want to. We are out of here. We negotiated only for two good negotiation work. picks. I think, I think we, we have a total of 11. Workers. Um, so I think one mech part of a Shadowhawk and some little tidbits and we're good. So staying longer would give us a bit more money, but honestly, this is a quest line, so we will get some extras anyway when we are finishing the whole storyline, so it's fine. Ooh, and another thing we could do, depending on the difficulty of the mission, I think there is a special pilot around here that we can try to get, and he also comes with a mech. It's a good auto cannon. Yeah, man, ah, so close. So close to get the Shadowhawk, to get two Shadowhawk parts, that's what I wanna say. Uh, Hollander, only a 45 toner, I'm not really too keen on getting it, we're gonna take it later. So one Shadowhawk part, and an Assassin part. Yeah, I'm looking for medium mechs, so we pick medium mechs. Kablam. 1 million C-bills. Okay, so that's what we get. That's our payout here. Bit of C-bills. A good chunk of reputation. Um, and then an auto cannon. LBX, 10, auto cannon. Tier 0. Two double heat sinks. Hey, look at that. That's good. That's, that's helpful. Again, we are in like super early stages, so there's no good tech yet. I like the doubles, but... In order to run the doubles, we have to find the double heat sink kit. You cannot easily put them and mix and match them with the singles that we have. Ha! Now that's a problem. So let's go ahead and salvage assembly. Take a look at the assassins. I am just hoping that I get an engine out of that. Let's go and assemble this bad boy. Come on. Are you good? Ah! Ah! Hmm. Well, I mean, at the very least, we don't have to super repair everything it's still a lot if we get a core this guy might be worth it it's a 40 toner uh -huh. okay I'm, I'm doing it in an industrial hub not here in the conflict zone but this could be our next mech honestly yeah let's let me go ahead and max armor real quick probably want to keep like two jump jets for baseline mobility something along those lines not even the medium laser. This is just SRMs and an engine and, you know, cooling, 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 cooling. So, yeah, want to check real quick. Can I put this in there? No. Uh, it conflicts with the singles. So, that's not an option. What if I drop the singles altogether? Yeah, it still is based on a single heat sink cooling in the, in the engine. Makes sense. Totally makes sense. So, I'm gonna repair my little guys here. We're gonna keep the assassin for the moment. Could build another Irby. And I know a lot of people want to see the urban lands. I I know you guys. What's that? Rival mercs. Oh, okay. So the rival mercs are showing up now. Do we want to play the exploration mission? I don't know. I don't think that we can play Fortress 25. Why is this yellow? Like, is this so special? What do we get out of this in the end? Never played Fortress, I believe. It's a 2 million payout, which is nice. I want to do this here, though. 
This is GTE. This is the... Uh, what other faces? Uh, objective locks. What was it? Chainsaw? Gather the elite. That's what it's it. What it is. Gather the elite. What's the face? Snowshoe. All right, let's take a look at snowshoe real quick. Objective lock. Snowshoe comes with a shutterhawk. Oh, yes. And he's a good pilot. He has a max cap of sixty. We should probably try to get that guy. Uh, it's not a probably. That's a definitely. And that auto cannon burst fire pack of two. Also fantastic. All right. Our CO signed us up for a four-month defensive operation with uh, about a month's worth of supplies. Can you see a problem there? I've missed my third monthly check-in. We are probably starving to death and out of ammo. We'll forage, he says. <laughs> anyway, I, I got wind of your unit from the local girls who apparently served with you in the past. No one else will help our situation, but she said you might for the right price. If you get this message, message, that means you are still in my area. Please find me at the enclosed coordinates and make sure I'm not already dead. I'll be sure to make it up to you. So this guy will join our squad. Um, yeah, I probably want to play the exploration anyway. All right. So empty the nest. Uh, demolition. I mean, since we are on the planet, we should probably stay here and play all of these, right? But hey, let's go for salvage. It's only salvage that we can get. And we are again under our maximum allowance here. Ugh. All right. We're reading heavy weather warnings out there, Commander. Expect limited visibility. Yeah, a bunch of people are bruised in this fight. This I don't know why that exactly is. I don't also want to wait for them to recover. Sorry, I'm that guy. Don't get killed, all right? So, we're gonna take little Herbie guy, and we're gonna try to explore this. Try to see if I can um, live through the, the fights alone. But I think I could take a battle buddy with me. You know what? I'll take the Locust with me. I think that would be good. The Javelin currently runs short-range missiles, right? Yeah, I believe so. So... Oh, I might be the better guy. I might be the better guy to take with me for a bit more burst. Yeah. Leave the Locust and the Fire Starter to defend the dropship. And I'm gonna take the, the Javelin with me. Oh, it's raining. It is raining. So where's the dropship? All right, Commander, All right. you know the drill. Recon teams have spotted a number of locations that are most likely to I know the, the kind of drill. things that we need. This region is are you going there? I'm not entirely sure if that command came through. Pirates. They will not hesitate to open fire on you, so make it quick. Out. So you go there. On the move. And follow Javelin, me. follow me. Where do we go first? I think it's Alpha, Gamma, Beta, Delta, something like that. I'm detecting unidentified yeah, let's make this... Uh, Make this happen in a reasonable way. Uh, also, <laughs> night vision. <laughs> we gotta do it. Alright, got some tanks closing in. Um, you know what? These, those will probably attack the dropship. I'll let my people handle it. Yeah, it's fine. It's totally fine. So again, the most efficient way is probably Alpha, Gamma, Beta. And then we decide if we want to also go to Delta or if we go back. And that's what I mean. I like the explosion that our SRM carrier uh, is bringing here. All right. So, close to Alpha. There is a very damaged Panther. Check, check. Enemy mech is broadcast. Hey, Panther. Down, Don't broadcast. I need you to do to die. Oh. <laughs> Crit warning, yeah. <laughs> Kablam. So, map point alpha, here we are. We're scanning already. Is there any hidden loot that we can also take with us? No, nope, there's a turret. Uh, Alright, we found a variety uh, of sorry, ammunition. Alright, that's pretty lame. It is pretty lame. There's nothing really that I'm excited about ammunition here. Following. Yo, Javelin, follow me. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that you are very proud of yourself now. Destroying a turret. Okay, I'm gonna destroy the other turret so he's not getting caught up in that. And can follow me. Gamma. Oh, there are VTOLs approaching now. Can you handle it, guys? I, I do believe so. We, we have a bunch of medium lasers there. 
Okay, sending in the attack order on Urbi. Heavy rifle. Um, low hanging fruits first. The small laser needs to go. Easy kill. Back to Urbi. And yes, there is extra loot on this planet, on this uh, station here. Nat point, whatever you want to call it. I cannot believe that he still lives. Stay behind him and kill him. All right. So, Rihanna said that there is something to find here somewhere. Hmm. Where? Oh, right here. All right, good. Scanning, scanning, scanning. And we found tier three weapons on this station. Very good. So far, we're not really taking that much damage, so... I guess we go to, to, to beta. CT is gonna blow out, I'm out. Who said that? There was an enemy pilot. Somebody just got killed. It might have been on the dropship. Mm, more loot, love it. You can probably explore the whole map and find more of these caches. But I'm just here for the nap points, and if I find something randomly, I'll take it. Did I, did I pick the other one? Because I think this is the first thing that we actually got here. Oh. I love the 360. Don't like that. It's taking a lot. Oh god, it's a kid fox! Ha! Alright. Just breach it. Where's Erby? I really hope my friends can take the kid fox out. Alright, what are you? Scorpion. I know that there's an urban mech behind us still. There he is. Tag, please. Come on, buddy. Devlin, shoot your weapons. He's not shooting his weapons. I don't know why. Uh, the heavy rifle. It's nasty. He's not really accurate, though. What are you? SRM. Let's get rid of that first. Good. And again, stay in motion. I don't know why my javelin is not participating in this fight. It really feels like I'm completely alone. Might be... Uh, might be because... Can I please not be stuck? Thank you. Uh, it might be because my pilots are trash. I don't know. Because they have not a lot of expertise yet. There was a burst of SRMs. Ugh. Basically fighting this with machine guns only here. Stay here. Critical. Nut shot. Actually, butt shot. And Irby is down. So, scanning. Scanning, scanning, scanning. I think we just destroyed a Kid Fox there. That's great salvage. I love the occasional random clan mech that's coming in. Alrighty then. We found a double heatsink. A double heatsink. Singular. Oh my god. We need a kid for that. Alright, we can jump. And then we can get stuck here. Nope. Waiting for the jump jet juice. Yeah, maybe going around would have been faster than trying to wiggle my way up here. Anyway, let's go. So, Javelin, follow me. Just follow me. So, the status of the Locust is fantastic. The status of the Firestarter, not so much. We should probably bail out soon. But I want to get a look at the last nav point. Let's go to Delta. We might find something good in there. There's always a chance that you get, like, the like the 1 million Seabill lottery ticket. Good. Very important to take that carry out quickly. Don't flame me. Set don't. Thank you. Right, on towards Delta. What do we see? Bunch of turrets. A turret you attack, huh? Fine. Ammo low. Okay. So last engagement. Here it comes. That's a turret. That's a tank. No mech so far. 
SRM J Edgar. Got it. There is an additional treasure here, which I appreciate. That's pretty cool. Stay on the tracks or on the hoverboard. There we go. So, we're scanning. It's good. That means no enemies any anywhere close. While we're scanning, we also pick something up. Alrighty then. Package acquired. Package acquired. We got a flamer. Hey, one tier two flamer. Damn, Commander. That's a good one. And Sounds another stash of tier three weapons. Inbound. Good. Uh, oh, I have I have the stupid bug where I am stuck in the orientation with my legs when I swap to another cockpit. So I couldn't use the fire starter to actually move. But hey, let's take the locust. Phew. You have way too much fun destroying the turrets out there. Alright, let's go home and see what we actually got here. Probably worth it. We will we will have to repair some of the mechs, especially the fire starter who lost another medium laser. But I guess it's fine since the tier 3 weapons might be worth it. I'm kind of hoping for SRMs, honestly. Let's see. Very low C bills. This is not what the exploration is all about. It's all about the loot. We've got some ER larges, two of them. Tier 3 LB10X autocannon. Two of them. A tier 0 LRM15. A tier 2 flamer. And a bunch of ammo as well as a double heatsink. Not bad. And then we have 30 salvage picks. I, I gotta take the Kid Fox. Come on, we can't possibly get. Wait, no, it's an Omni Mech. That means we cannot get the XL engine. Uh, yeah, I mean, why not? Why not? Is there any, anything in terms of clan equipment here? Anything? Nothing? Absolutely nothing. Right. I guess we'll pick some Urbies. Get all the Urbies, get all the Panthers, all the Commandos. Sure. And then one pick for an LRM-10 tier 0. So, not bad. Absolutely not bad. Means I can build this primitive urban mech for 100,000. I want to see. I'm just curious. So the primitive engine can be just removed for a lot of money. Oh boy. What's the downside of the primitive, by the way? Let me quickly revert that. I want to see. Um, compared to the Star League, blah, blah, blah. 80% more size. Hmm. It's hard to tell. If that's even, like, hindering us. By the way, this is a good urban mech. We got like four energy hard points. And then basically two machine gun hard points. So we could make it four medium lasers, maybe, and a bunch of cooling. And maybe machine guns, maybe even not. That's uh, that's decent for an Irby. We have the Urban Mech armor here. We have a narrow profile for a 15% chance to just completely avoid incoming fire. And another narrow profile quirk, which gives us evasion. Uh, that's a good Irby. But in order to do just this, to just repair 100 days and 1.3 million Z-Builds. Ow. Yeah, I guess we have them. For the moment. Can build another one of those. Nah. Hmm. I don't know. Get an R60? Engine is gone as well. Are they selling for anything? Oh, that's totally not worth assembling them. <laughs> that is not worth... Oh, God. So we either use them or we, we drop the individual parts because the sell value of one part is 133,000 already. So we basically paid for nothing. And just lost five times 133,000. So I don't know. I don't know. I was kind of hoping that we get some items out of this. And I mean, technically we get the chemical lasers, but bleh, not good. Anyway, we are going for a rescue mission now, guys. That's what we are here for. Ah, yes. Wait a sec. Before we do anything, let me stop the fire starter work order because we need to replace a medium laser as well. Which will be done automatically. Good. Okay. So again, the other guys are eh, irrelevant right now. I'm not going to play the demolition contract. I just don't feel like it right now. Let's go here and... Get a proper medium mech, as well as a good pilot. I'm just waiting for it. What's the difficulty rating, though? Can we do it?
That's 42. I mean, it's a defense mission. Oh, uh, we will face heavy max. Uh, I feel like we need medium max to begin with. I don't think I can run it right now. This is a war zone, a battlefield. Doesn't matter. So waves of enemies coming towards us. I could maybe cheese it with airstrikes, but we gotta get like really lucky here. Forty-two. I'm struggling with twenties already. I I no. I this is this is death. I'm not gonna do it. Sorry. I know you want to see it, but I'm not gonna play it. The fortress. Oh, there's a twenty-five. Oh, I don't know. I think we can uh, we can maybe try it later. I'm gonna go back now. Yeah. Bit of back and forth, bit of travel time and cost. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and play the demolition. Get some salvage. Get some negotiation in terms of money. And uh, yeah, demolition should be quite fine with the mechs that we have. I, as soon, I think as soon as I got my first reliable medium mech, I might be willing to take these challenges. Something like, give me give me one Shadowhawk with a decent build, and I'm willing to play it. And then we also have, like, Irby and Firestarter and Javelin. These guys could probably shred enemies. But we gotta be really fast with it, and we need some, some sturdiness as well. Attention. Prepare for battle mech departure. Or maybe the enemies will not fire at us, I don't know. <laughs> they forget how to pull the trigger. Yeah. It's just the damage output of a bunch of online. medium and heavy mechs that we cannot Sentry withstand for long. Online. So, sorry. Online. Not gonna happen. All systems nominal. Our target is an industrial complex right. marked on your tactical Blup. display. Blup. Our employer wants Blup. it gone, and we aim to please. Blup. 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 Light that complex up like a New Year's celebration, Commander. Good. So, we are also here for some salvage. I hope that enemies will actually show up, and uh, we will find some mediums here. The answer is probably no, but I will also settle with some value. The other thing I could do is just go for the economic route and just take money and just buy myself a media mag. But I said it often enough, I think. This is not what I like to play. I like the, the thrill of the unexpected. I like to be surprised. I want to loot. I want to earn it. Great. There's a guy behind me. Another assassin. Hey, maybe this is the route that we have to go. Just assassins. Uh, I want to try to take the mech first before we go anywhere else. There he is. Okay. Uh, let's go. Having two assassins in the lands might be good enough. Come on. Get wrecked. Okay, just peppering all of these single panel things with machine guns. And then we're gonna... We're gonna walk through the bigger buildings. <laughs> oh, this feels so good, man. Let's check, try to take the tank as well while we're at it. Okay. So, this is it. Oops. Oh, there's a loot cache! I didn't even see it. Okay, more panel shredding and then walking through the buildings. You did it, Commander. I did it! Hell yeah. Now, let's get out of here okay. before more We gotta go to evac. Head to the evac zone. But not before I take jump this with me. I really like the baseline mobility that these jump jets provide. That doesn't mean I'm gonna use him on the heavy max necessarily. But hey. Excellent find, Commander. Machine gun level one! Yeah, you guys said I should upgrade my machine guns, and you might be actually right. We can take a look at that. We have a, we have a bunch of them, and I'm using a lot of them, and they are easy picks. So, picking machine guns, and then using the upgrade system to make them good, is totally viable. Absolutely. I think in the early game, it's, it's valuable. I'll take another one. Why not? Let's go. Got it. We'll be sure to put that ammo to good and use. that is just ammunition. All right. Yeah. I'm always getting excited when I see these blue pillars uh, lighting their light into the sky. <sighs> and then that. 
but it's nice that this exists because you can look out for these caches uh, when you are in the middle of a fight and you are running out of ammo you're like oh crap i need more so give me that so i can sustain myself a little longer Alrighty then so that was a demolition mission very well done very fast as well mm. and do i want the assassins i don't know i just don't know i mean i'll pick him And then I probably pick some medium lasers as well here so we can possibly upgrade them. All right. So, yeah, let me take a look at that. We go to Battle Max and we go to weapon upgrades here. Uh, and we can obviously upgrade some uh, flamers, some large lasers, some medium lasers, and some machine guns from tier 1 to tier 2. I can upgrade one. All right, I'll do it. I also upgrade some medium laser tier 0 to tier 1. Sure, two of them are better now. And we can upgrade to tier 2 as well. Flamers? At the moment, I'm actually happy that I have some flamers. So I'm probably not drop three of them to get one. Let's use these, I guess. Also, again, Herbies. Are we building the whole squad? I don't know. We should probably drop them, because they cost us upkeep. Uh, what's what's the difference, actually? Uh, 239,000. Uh, I mean, I could put them to, to cold storage, right? Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. And wait, since the mechs don't lose their bills, I can just do this. And then bring them back. Whenever I need to. This would be very optimal to do right now. Uh, Alright. Cool. I'll take it. Why not? So. That being said. I am not done today guys. We are going to Guntar. Because Guntar gives me an 8v8 duel. Hmm. Let me, let me reconsider. Is this all tier very low? Like really low? Should we play the fortress? I think we're gonna prepare for the fortress. And then we're gonna play fortress uh, next next time. Another exploration. Alright. It's a resource mission. Which I will totally take. You know what? I will I will do it, but we will play the defense stronghold first, because that's always fun. It's one of my absolute favorite um, uh, mission types right now. I love it. So let's go ahead and try to get these mission points so that we can build turrets and we're gonna wait for waves and waves of enemies. How does it work though? With the last wave? Because the last wave is a challenge wave. And we are like really bad in our mech setup. But the mission tier is also very low. So I really wonder what they are bringing us as a challenge here. There might be something good. It might be a swarm of lots of VTOLs which will totally, totally destroy us. But let's, let's check it out. Very keen on getting this. Ready for launch. Three, two, one. And here we go. So I didn't really have the time to actually learn the the color codes of the turrets. The emplacements. But let's see. Alright. So, green is like medium laser, right? Okay, let's restock ammo. Greetings, Commander. There this is, is the something. Speaking. Medium this laser turret for 10. I'll take it. Alright, alright, alright. Anti-air turret. Sure. Let's get Three that going. That is another medium laser. Over four large lasers. You know what? I kind of want to upgrade that, but I'm not entirely four sure. Oh, God. This is a very... Like a rather big base. I want another anti-air turret. Because these can get really nasty. That's LRM-10. Uh, yeah, fine. Alright. There's nothing here. Alright. We got another turret here, which is also anti-air. Flamer. Alright, this guy I think I'm gonna upgrade because it's right on the gate. 
All right, 10 more points. I think we used basically everything that we could. There's one more here. This is large laser, right? It's a decoy. Sure, you know what? Attack decoy. Why not? So secondary objective, find a salvage uh, extra 40 DP at the location. We can make that push out. Oh, wait, there's another perimeter. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There's a lot here. Yeah, we'll, we'll try to take those. Let's go. Coordinating on target ID. So, onto the Scorpion. Then we take the Wasp or whatever that light make is on the right side. And Target then we're gonna destroyed. salvage. So we can build more defenses. Eh. Guys, take him. We wanna keep our, our base clean of any enemies. So what's that? Acquired. Medium laser harasser? Uh, okay, we got the points already. That was quick. <laughs> Alright, harasser has some problems. Get him down, and I'll take the thing here. Sure, before we go any further. Right. That's a Hollander, and he's attacking the base, guys. Let's go. Another tank, which is not in a good spot, I believe. He's not moving, so I believe he's also flipped over. So what are we doing with 77 drop points? Hmm. Just standing there. Oh. Face against the wall. Okay. Medium lasers? Sure. What are you, my friend? Share target identified. A decoy. I think I'm gonna say nah. Laser turret. Laser turret. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Large lasers, yes, please. What's this again? Gotta figure it out. AMS. Um. Yeah, maybe. I can see that. So we have one side quite well protected. Flamer, I don't care. I need some some more range, I believe. Is this a large laser? If so, I'm gonna take that. Medium. Yeah, fine. Okay. So, did you get the hostile unit? No, you didn't. You idiots. Come on, guys. I gave you a clear order and you didn't follow. Oh my god. So, large lasers, we have a bunch of them here. Focus engagement What's this? Target. Is this a spawner? AMS turret. Okay. I really want to find this spawn turret because having a, a, a vehicle or a mech uh, additionally here is totally fine. Boy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh wait, this the white one maybe. This might also be ammo. Yeah. So, where's the tank? Guys, come on. We need to find it. The problem with the mission is it usually takes a little longer than other missions because of the, the finicky... Uh, nature of it. Zap zap. You gotta do you everything yourself here. Lemo. So, down he goes. Destroy the Manticore wave. Manticores are nasty. We should probably not engage directly. Not if all of them are together because they have PPCs and like LRMs and. Ugh. Target acquired. SRM-6, medium laser, and they are attacking from the other side. Well, that's a problem. What we have is a single medium laser turret. <laughs> Alright. So... They are attacking the walls, I believe. Uh-huh, yeah, it seems like... Uh, maybe... No, they are attacking the base directly. Or is it one of our turrets? Yeah, they actually attacked my medium laser turret. Ooh, large laser. But you know what? We need we need more of these points. Uh, da -da -da -da. Incoming, missile. Incoming missile. Decoy. Alright, you take the Target decoy. Acquired. I really hope that helps. Because these guys will shoot us. Copy. We're on it, sir. And they will not stop. That's, that's crazy, man. Manticores are no joke. You can see how long it takes to take one of them. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. The important thing is that we underrun the minimum distance of the LRMs to mitigate a bit of the damage. But then there's also SRM fire coming. Get wrecked. Thank you. Next up. Good news is it's only five. So the damage output is manageable. I run. Alright. And then this one. Yeah, I wonder if my decoy is down already or not. Hello. Oh my god. I don't want to get hit by your PPC, please. So we're going to stay in motion because the more you move, the higher evasion you basically get and the less your enemies will hit you. If you stand still, they just get a better aim. They just have a higher percentage based on your base speed. That was very surprisingly doable. Enemy destroyed. Good. Finish that. Prepare for next wave. We have 25 seconds. Oh my god. I want one of these large lasers so we have a bit of range so we can attack them a bit earlier. It's a large laser. And I think there was one more here. Upgrade the decoy. Mm. Yeah. Let's do it. I just hope that they have more health as a result. So, defeat hostile units. Where are you coming from, my friends? We have no idea yet. Um, also, what's wrong with my turret situation here? Oh, we just don't see them. Because we have shitty sensors. That's, that's why. Okay. No enemies thus far. Oh, here they come. Oh my god. Uh, wait. Pokey ahead. That is a problem. Target acquired. That is a huge problem. Oh my freaking god. Um, um, fine. Let's take him. I mean, I do have that anti-air turret here. That should help. And I just upgraded it. No, I did not. Never mind. I didn't have enough of these. Of these points. Okay. Some of them down. New target. Uh, New I need target. to gate. We need to get out of here. Or are we going to wait for the next flyover to get some more DP? We have 18 now. And that is the 20. But now we don't need that upgraded anti-air turret anymore. Because the, the air wave is gone. Also extra salvage possible. I need, I need a breach here. Can I have that? It doesn't seem like it. It seems like we only get that one gate. Okay. Uh, fine. We'll take the gate. Follow me, oh, friends. Six, to glory and victory. It's also extra DP outside. Uh, it's quite far away, though. Should I take it? I don't know. Not yet. We'll figure it out. There's one medium mag in form of a Clint. Ooh, Clint got wrecked already. Our turrets are doing a good job. Don't want medium laser. If anything, it's gonna be large. Decoy down. So it was totally worth it. Having that decoy. Get wrecked, Clint. Commander, we have lost one of our medium lasers. Ah, yeah, now they're going for the turrets. We good? I think I buy another decoy. So. Um, destroy the spider swarm is what they are telling me. Weird. Coming from the other side this time. Oh, there's a scorpion spawner. I don't know if the tank is actually coming with us. But, hey, let's see. I like the spawners. So, medium laser is trying its best to not get wrecked. Large laser is helping. Yeah, 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 we got some damage on these spideys. Ah, the medium laser turret is gonna get destroyed, though. This is the, the sad thing about it, that they are so damn squishy. Ah, it's probably gonna go down. Let's go. Get wrecked, little spiderling. Good, we got that guy. Oh, he's almost lagged. Make it. Make it happen. 
Look at all the laser beams in the sky. That's so cool. All right. We did get everything. Ah. So, 35 seconds. Um, I want you to stay here, guys. I'm going to try to take this. The salvage. The extras. And then we're going to just build some turrets like crazy. Depending on where the wave is going to come. I'm at your designated position. Thank you, friends. I'll hop into your cockpit in a second. At the requested position, Commander. Got 15 seconds. Uh, it's pretty far out, man. So, five seconds until the next wave is coming. It's not the final wave, I believe. Defeat hostile units, 16 of them. 16 is a lot. I'm just hoping that the base is holding. You've found the targeted asset. You gotta be kidding me! Oh, I have to. Procedure. I have to do it. Sorry, I'm greedy. Look, get that. Cargo acquired. So we did get a uh, bunch of seabills. Yeah, just a bunch of seabills. So with the acquired salvage DP, I'd say we have enough Secondary to actually objective. reinforce acquired. like crazy. Secondary. Another four hostile units. I don't like that. What do we face? Ooh, that's a lot of tanks. That's a lot of them. Okay, we got it. We go for the fire starter. And again, we gotta reinforce that flank. Let's go. Oh, there's a mech. Target. <sighs> yeah, I feel like I have to take that guy. Can I leave it to my to my turrets here? Uh, I don't think so, actually. I don't think so. All right, light mech down. You are going for the heads like crazy. Medium mech Hollander. Target engaged. Maybe we can leave it to the to the turrets. Wanna get your your gals rifle? Awkward to run in, in arm lock mode. I hate that. Whitworth. Oh god, the other flank is just collapsing. On the commander's target. Come on, you can take a Whitworth, right? Yeah, with a, with an LRM build, I think you can just underrun that guy and just crash him. He's also running XL, so is he not? No, he totally is. Okay, totally is. Alrighty then. Man, this flank. Shared target identified. Uh, medium laser turret, no. Medium laser turret, no. Inter air, I'm gonna take that. Because target I believe there will be more of these flying units. Commander, okay. we have lost one of our decoys. Decoy down! No! Poor little decoy. Now they're going for the real turrets. Commander, we have yeah. lost one of our large. Alright, we need to get turrets. that decoy up and running. Again. Right, and then we're gonna upgrade that large laser turret to the max. Cool. Um. Yeah, let's go. Let's just kill all of this. The decoy should be. Oh no! It's a big even. I am so dead. I. No. No. Alright. That was dumb. That was dumb as hell, facing that behemoth like that. Upgrade the laser turret. I was really hoping that my, my decoy would do a little bit more than that. Let me go for Irby again. Oh, this is not in a good spot either. Yeah, 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 yeah. I thought it was just a regular, like, scorpion or so. And when I realized, I already lost my sight or so. What's shooting the ballistics? You got auto cannon tens on top of that. Oh my god. I mean, that's pretty good. So we can find extra salvage. Uh, yeah, but that's too way too far away. I am not gonna go there. Target acquired. A okay, bunch of Edgars. All right. Got him. What are you? <laughs> Is he dead? I really hope so. Target cool. Destroyed. And that's the last. Target no, not acquired. really. 
Who's the last guy even? Can I kill this? Should I kill this? Probably. Yeah, he was not part of the active lands. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, javelin hit in the back. Mm hmm. Got 69 DP right now. Nice. And yes, again, the, the mission is. Ah, uh, yes. Guys, follow me. The mission is really long and full of terrors. And I really hope that the. Uh, it's, it's worth it. I just hope that it's worth it. Uh, I know that there is an enter air turret somewhere here that I probably want to upgrade. A bit of stuff is happening already, so that's good. One VTOL down. They will do Target some flybys in our direction, so having another enter air turret here makes sense. Target destroyed. Uh, come on, medium laser. We have some Base points. Being captured. Yeah, 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 I know. Get the turrets out there, and again, that enter air turret, we need it now. Upgrade. And upgrade again. Yeah, we are doing it. We are totally doing it. I don't even have to do anything. Ah, so, final wave for a light mech reward. Do not let hostiles capture the base. I will do my very best. I could extract now, but you know what? I said it earlier, I'm saying it again. I am greedy as hell, so let's just stay. Ceasing fire. Telling my people to hold fire. Is that spawner here? Get a scorpion out there. Why not? So, seizing fire here so that my friends don't attract fire. And then we're gonna see what's come, gonna come here. I should probably wait for the enemies to come to me. We have a bunch of large lasers here on that flank. That's great. Alright. A light mech reward. I will totally take that. Depending on what it is. What are you again? LRM turret. I saw some LRMs flying into the sky, but I didn't see any flying against enemy mechs or vehicles on the ground. So I think this LRM turret is not great. It's not worth upgrading. Alright. Stay and destroy the remaining enemy hostiles. We have a total of... Cannot see it right now. Um, a total of 21 and... Another wave of five coming from somewhere. I'm happy to, to see VTOLs, by the way, because we just upgraded that enter air turret. And you know what? We're gonna chill in the base. Let them do the work for us. I don't have to do anything here. Yep. It's giving us a good chunk of DP. I mean, I can do a little bit. I'm helping. Target destroyed. Hi, I'm a turret. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Target destroyed, target destroyed, target destroyed. Perfect. And this is spider, wasp, as well as another assassin. Uh, you know what? Target acquired. Oh, wait. Target destroyed. I will actually wait. Oh, um, do I? One of the units is already dead. That's what I can tell you, because I have it here on my mission status report. Alright, let's take a look. New target assassin. Yeah. Target Light him up. Target acquired. Target uh, I, I think we won. We, we totally won. Our laser autocannon turret here is doing some target work. Destroyed. And is not attacked yet. Alright. We did it. Wait. We did not... Whoa, we didn't do it yet. We didn't do it yet. There is a wave of LRM max coming. Oh my god, where's the AMS turret? Uh-uh-uh. Here's my Scorpion, by the way. I like having spawned units around. New target, trebuchet. Oh, trebuchet. LRM, wait, AMS turrets were on the corners, if I remember correctly. This might be large laser, right? Let me see. Medium laser. Is this large? Oh. Yeah, missiles are already flying. Decoy. Auto cannon 2 is good. Can shoot at range. Yeah, they are destroying my base from long range, which is a huge problem. I'll take the auto cannon 2 turret. Because it can actually retaliate. 
bam, bam, ba bam. Yep, the decoy. Um, and then we're gonna let him come. Yeah, let, let, let's let's stay here, guys. Falling in behind you. New target, Dervish. Dervish. Oh, target Dervish is nasty one. because of SRMs. Let the turrets do the work here. Took a nasty hit there. It's fine. Target destroyed. Totally fine. Target acquired. Am I gonna go for one of these Dervishes? Commander, <laughs> we have lost one of our AC2 Oh, AC2 turret down. I think we have to engage. Okay, let's go. Oh, really? You got hit once and you're dead? Oh, no. That's a problem. Much a problemo here. That's a locust down. I think we have to actually take the cicada or actually refit our assassin, which we probably want to do anyway. Or use the light mech reward that we are about to get, huh? Get wrecked. Thank you. Alrighty. Ah, I was unfortunate. We did try to keep him safe. We didn't. Make your arms shred. There we go. And that is it! So, Tori Liu has been missing in action. Oh, I'm sorry. Maybe we can get her back. Do I care? It's probably not the biggest of deals since we are looking for better pilots anyway. But we should really stock up on pilots then. We'll see. Okay. You might come back at some point. We just got a free fire starter for this whole mission. Okay, I feel like Coyote changed something about the reward system here. And that is absolutely worth it. That is a fresh free fire starter for that long of a mission. Great. Balancing on par, I would say. Yes, we took a good chunk of damage here. Yes, we lost the Locust, but we replaced it with a fire starter. Easy. Uh, I'll take the fusion core since we want to build something. No, I don't. We'll take Whitworth parts. Because that's XL possibilities here. Do I want the dervishes? I mean, the answer is yeah. <laughs> totally. But we don't have enough picks left over. That's the problem. Maybe I'll take one Whitworth part because we only need one to finish it. And then also take a Hollander part. Because we also want to finish that. It's the 45 ton Hollander. Yeah, that seems good. That seems very good. Here's a Gauss rifle. I don't really care about it, though. Not right now. All right, let's go for an LRM for a little bit of money. Unless there's anything down here that gives me some value with only one pick. But I don't think so. So we don't do it. Ugh. All right. Missing an action. I'm sorry. You should have better watched out in your little locos. My total damage is 1.6 mil. We have a payout of 1 mil. But... There's the fire starter. I was like, where, where is he? Yeah, he is a fresh fire starter. FS9A. And I am so happy to see him. Uh, mostly because it's also the energy variant, which we can totally fill up with medium and small lasers or just flamers or so. So we don't have to fiddle around with machine guns and their ammo and stuff like that. It's good. It's really, really good. All right. Another thing I want to do now. Here's a Whitworth. Come on. Fingers crossed. Are we getting lucky? No. We're not getting lucky. However, I'm pretty happy to see that we got an engine core 160. So that's some value. None of these good weapons are in here. Ah. Well, well, well. No XL engine for us either. It's lost tech. Intro date is 35. Holy crap. 35? We are 17 right now. I guess we have to we have to play a little. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. That has been it for today, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.